The explosive growth in smartphone and tablets coupled with video and cloud-based data traffic have spurred innovation and at an unprecedented level. Markets in Motion starts right now. TIA's annual market review and forecast was released just today, giving us the latest data, predictions, and trends for the tech industry. Here in the studio to comment on the 2012 MRNF is Ron Westfall of Current Analysis, Ken Rabin of Yankee Group, and Arthur Gruen of Wilkowski Gruen Associates, and the principal author of TIA's ICT market review and forecast. And gentlemen, welcome to the program today. It's great to be here. Nice Ar to be here. Uh, nice to have you, Arthur, and uh, we do speak to you on that annual basis, and we appreciate the plethora of information in your MRNF for 2012. Thank you. Thank you for being here, and of course, Ron, you've been on the show several times. We appreciate you coming into the studio, and Ken, you've been with us uh, one time. We appreciate you coming back as well. Great to be back. Great to have you. Uh, Arthur, let's start with you. Uh, you have witnessed the upticks and downturns in the industry over a number of years. Can you give us some of the top line numbers going forward through 2015? Okay, thank you and uh, nice again to be back and sharing uh, our views on what's going on in the industry uh, going forward. Um, just before I begin, this is just uh, a not even the tip of the iceberg in terms of what's in the market review and forecast. Uh, we're just going to give you a little uh, hint on what the top line is, but the book is over 500 pages and contains reams of data, and if you're a data hound like I am, uh, I think you'll find it useful. Uh, going to the first slide, just uh, the uh, overview on the global market. We're coming out of the recession now, and uh, so we're now looking at an upswing, uh, which is a brighter picture than we were reported two or three years ago. Uh, the international uh, markets will be growing faster than the U.S. market, and most of that growth is going to be in Asia and Latin America. And in Asia, uh, most of that growth is being driven by China and India, where uh, even though they have large markets, uh, the huge populations, penetration of broadband and wireless is still low. There's a lot of room for growth there, and that's going to be driving uh, spending in that area. Latin America is uh, uh, also low penetration areas, and they're going to be expanding as well. Moving to the next slide, looking at the U.S. market. Uh, the U.S. market was hurt by the recession in 2009 and uh, uh, 2010 stabilized. Now we're looking at an upswing going forward uh, based on uh, growing demands for data, and which we'll uh, look at in the next few slides. Also, the expectation that the nascent economic recovery will start to build some momentum going forward. So we're looking at an, a, a generally expanding economy going forward, which would be uh, in contrast with the last uh, few years where we had some serious economic problems.